Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Something really exciting today, in my opinion. Um, and Hypen put out uh, dance practice, Halloween dress up version of Chamber 5, uh, Dream of Dreams. Super excited about it. I love this track um, from watching Island. It's one of my favorites. Um, I'd say it's probably my third favorite calling run to use probably my favorite um and then under that would be flicker i can't get enough of flicker but this is so close with flicker for me i love this track um i wasn't sure how i was gonna like it because it is so such a cutesy and i and I, it's not that i don't like cutesy at all um it's just i really have to be in the mood sometimes for it but i, I never don't want to listen to this song it pops up in my head all the time um so i'm really excited to check this out and just to react to something for the boys, I haven't done any reactions on the channel for the boys. I did some stuff on Twitch watching some of the episodes. Um, I think it was the last last three episodes. Um, I didn't do the finale uh, because I was actually part of the global audience. So hi, I'm excited to check this out, guys. It's just going to be fun. Get to see the boys. And I'm interested to see um, what the part arrangement would be because this was normally, what, five was it five people, right? At He Sung, Jake, Jung Wan, Sung Hoon, and Sun Nu. We didn't have anybody else. I don't think, if I'm not mistaken. So we only had five previously, and now we got seven because that's how many members we have. So Jay and Nikki are going to be in the mix. And I'm excited to check that out because we really, Nikki, we've seen be a goofball, and we've seen Jay be a goofball too, but we've seen a plenty of like Nikki being a goofball, you know, off, off of the stage. But we've really, really never got to see him be cutesy. I mean, the closest would have been maybe DNA, and it's not even a cutesy song, but it's a little bit more more laxed. Um, and then Jay never got the chance to show that side of him on stage. So I'm excited to check this out. Just have fun with it and see what the see what the parts are. All right, guys, let's check this out. Chamber Five, Dream of Dreams, and Hypen Halloween Fruit Version. Um, I'm wondering if this must have been when they were talking about fruits and stuff um, in one of the other one of the V lives and they were talking about it on Twitter and stuff like that. I'm wondering if this was a, a hint, you know, if that was a hint to this. So let's get into this, guys. I've talked enough. I, I miss you guys. Um, I've been really tired lately because I've been working a lot. So uh, I haven't been able to upload as much and I apologize for that. Um, but let's get into this, guys. Man, look at this brand new dance like practice room this all part of the new building <laughs> Jay so oh my goodness so apple oh my goodness <laughs> Okay, so we do have five down, and then two people in black in the back. So those are going to be just uh, extra dancers to help with uh, props because they did that in the they did that in the original performance as well. All right, parts are the same so far. <laughs> Look at this facial expression. Like, <laughs> Jungwani's got glasses on. Stem. Oh, Sandu, you're so freaking perfect. <laughs> oh my god, they're goofballs. Sandu's headpiece is so large. I can't remember what they said he was. Because you have he sung is a, an apple, uh, Jake's an orange, um, Jungwani was a uh, mango, it looked like, and then Sung Hoon was um, a blueberry. That's right. Uh, Sun Nu is a peach. 
Look how massive his is. <laughs> oh, I love this song. So I would assume that we're going to get Nikki and Jay in the rapping parts here because that was spread amongst um, everyone besides he sung did the second verse rap, but you had you had Jake, Sunghoon, Sanu, and Jungwani doing the rap portion here. So I would assume that's where Jay and Nikki because they look like they're rotating to the forward. Oh my God, Nikki Center, baby! Let's go, Jay. Jay looks so good with blonde hair right now. A versatile king. Are Jay, are they really not gonna have parts? I know this is just for fun, but it's just weird. The news is massive. <laughs> so would this be he sung like normal? Yep. Look, Nikki getting it back there. You see that? Oh, Nikki just freaking dance phenom. Even when he's not center, you just feel it. Nikki's smiling like a goon. This song just makes you so happy. I'm surprised Sanu has not gotten off balance with how massive that headpiece is. Like, look at him wobbling around. <laughs> There we go. We got Nikki and Jay. They've, they've had center parts here and singing parts here, even though they're not really singing since it's just a choreo version. Oh, that cute smile, Jay. Look at Jay's smile here. Oh. Nikki's been just goon smiling the entire time. Oh, Jake's thing fell off. When did that happen? <laughs> it's on? It's off. <laughs> Must be when he's playing messing with the pillow. Oh. <laughs> Jake went and grabbed it. <laughs> He's trying to eat some Hoon's blueberry. Oh, I needed that. It's been a long, like I said, I've been working constantly, guys. I've been working like overtime. I had one day off this week. So it's been busy, busy, busy for me. Um, and so I'm really excited to get this video recorded so that I can get this out to you guys. And I'm excited to see something from the boys. Um, you guys don't know because I didn't ever do anything on the channel really for them. Um, but I was a huge island um, watcher. I... I was, you know, into it before the show even started when they were just talking about it, doing eye blank interviews, all of that. And um, I'm just so excited to see the boys are they're cranking content out. I mean, they got so much content on, um, you know, their social media, you know, platforms and and all of the extra stuff that they do like V lives. They've been doing like V lives like crazy, which is just insane because of their debuting at the end of November. Like, I mean, I personally have said since Island, I'm pretty sure we're going to get uh, Dive Into You, Flickr, Chamber 5, and Flame On. I think all four of those will be on the debut album. And then we'll get, obviously, a title track. I think we might get 
one more B-side, maybe two. That's a lot of work, but these boys have been going hard for a long time, you know, being an island where they were really putting the pedal to the metal to get stuff done in a short amount of time. So um, I wouldn't be surprised if we got all of that. So I'm excited to see more from the boys. I wish I had reacted to the debut trailers because I was screaming, um, but I couldn't wait. <laughs> like I woke up or I was at work the one day and uh, I just had to watch it. I couldn't not. I couldn't wait till I got home. I, I am so in love with this group and these boys. I couldn't wait. <laughs> I I usually wait and react to pretty much everything. New releases, sometimes I have to wait whole days because I'm working and I don't have time to do it in the morning because it's usually like 5 a.m. where I live when stuff releases, and uh, I just couldn't for those. So we will obviously be doing their music video, their debut music video when that comes through, and then we'll do more stuff like this if they have more stuff like this. I'm really excited to uh, bring them into the channel because they're basically... Next to BTS, they are my old group now. I, I, I've grown with them from the first episode, from day zero, and I just, I, I these boys own me. I've spent so much money already on them. <laughs> I bought four albums so far. I bought two sets, and I'll probably buy more, to be honest. I'll probably buy some in store when they come to like Target by me. And uh, just to help with sales and because I, I just want to support and I want to uh, get as many other photo cards as I can. So anyways, I'm rambling because I'm excited to finally do and hyping on the channel. Um, so let me know, guys, what you think of this video? Uh, are you excited for these, you know, this type of content to be coming out from them already so early? Um, who's your bias? Mine is Jake. It's been Jake since day zero. That's never changed. Jay is my wrecker. Uh, I love all of them so much, though. Uh, just like BTS, it's one of those things where I have a bias because like, it's like the one whose aura just drew me in from the get-go. And then the rest of them just bias wreck me constantly. <laughs> and that's them. Um, so let me know, guys, what your, uh, what your bias is, what your take is on the album that we've you know got a lot of information about now, our debut on the 30th of November. How excited you guys are. I just want to talk to you guys down in the comments, my fellow engines. And uh, yeah, guys, thank you so much for stopping by the channel. And if you like this video, make sure you hit the thumbs up down below and subscribe if you want to see more content from me. And I'll see you guys down in the comments.